from spur to mushroom. Look at these mushrooms. How do they grow? First, a mushroom releases its spores. A mushroom spreads its cap. This part of the mushroom looks like an umbrella. Underneath it are soft parts called gills. Between the gills lie millions of spores. They wait to be released. They drift away on the wind. The spores land and start to grow. The spores are like seeds. Some land where mushrooms can easily grow. These spores sprout hyphae. These are a little like roots. Then they seek a mate. The hyphae snake through the soil. Two hyphae from different spores cross paths and join. When this happens, they can make a mushroom. The fungus grows roots. Mode hyphae shoot out to support the fungus. The hyphae form a part called the mycelium. It gathers nutrients the fungus needs to grow. Next, a mushroom bud forms. The fungus waits until conditions are right. Then it gets ready to send up its fruit. The mycelium forms a small bud at the surface of the soil. This will become the new mushroom. Soon a baby mushroom appears. The mushroom bud grows into a small, egg-like ball. It is protected by a soft outer shell called a veil. The shell contains a tiny mushroom. The mushroom breaks through its shell. The rounded cap of the mushroom breaks through the veil. Pieces of the torn veil can often be seen on the growing mushroom. The mushroom fruit takes shape. The mushroom grows larger and its tightly closed cap reaches outward. Different types of mushrooms develop in different ways. Each has its own unique shape. The new mushroom continues the cycle. The new mushroom is fully grown. It releases its spores on the wind. It provides meals for hungry bugs and animals, even humans. Then it decays, and new mushrooms sprout in its place. The end. Thanks for watching and please subscribe my channel.